Say she get it from her mama I'ma say you fuck her right Why you do this bump like Tell me in the home But come tell me is you now Hey guys, happy Wednesday So, Amazon just delivered a few new things guys like having a toddler is a whole sport okay but amazon just delivered some more things for christmas so let's see what we have i was waiting for these uh, but i'm excited it's work day by the way so i'm at work <laughs> so okay so in this box oh so in this box i have let me show you this is what the picture looks like so it's just some Christmas light, but you're able to like DIY and do stuff with it. It is so cute. We'll do it together. I'm thinking of putting it on my wall here. Oh, it'll be so cute. I'm excited. And then, and then in this box here, oh, so in this box here, I have, let me put this away. <laughs> Oh, it's so chaotic. But in this box here, I have some calendar. It's so cute, right? It's just some calendar blocks. And it's Christmassy, so I love it. I'll put this in the kitchen. And then this is the last one. This is actually really exciting for me. Because this is an advent calendar. So we have an advent calendar for Christmas. <laughs> this is what it looks like. Let me just take it off. And it just has wooden drawers and they are empty. So that's the, the that's the cute part, right? So they're empty. So what I want to do is I want to fill them up. I am going to be filling them up, okay, with just like cute stuff. And for Christmas, we're going to be opening every single day. Like, you know, it's, it's going to be cute. And I'm also doing Vlogmas this year. So, so this is what it looks like, right? And then you just put your stuff inside. So it's really cute <laughs> it's like really really cute so what i'm thinking of doing is again i'm gonna fill this up with like cute stuff from you know just from random things that i want to buy for myself and i'll just put them in random days it'll be so fun <laughs> i'll just put them in random days and you know they'll be like small things but they'll also be, be really cute stuff so i'm excited for christmas but yeah I'm gonna go back to work now. That's everything that I have. I'll see you guys when I close from work, okay? Hey guys, so my first stop is Walgreens. Um, I came into Walgreens to print some photos. Um, I don't really have anything else to do in Walgreens. I'm just walking around. What is that? Oh my God. <laughs> but um, I'm also thinking of picking up some body spray. So I might take a look at that and then we're gonna go buy some turkey because I do need some turkey. So let's do that. <laughs> Careful, man. Don't do that. Let's get a diaper for you. Say diaper, diaper. Diaper, diaper. We need a size six, man. Mm -hmm. Yeah, stupid. Hey guys, so we are in Price Chopper. <laughs> so I'm just buying, um, I'm buying turkey actually. I'm picking up some turkey for Thanksgiving. So that's why I'm here. I'm just gonna quickly pick that up and bounce. But yeah.
Hi. Hey, I don't know what you're saying, but hi. Hey you guys, so I am back home. Um, let me actually start off the vlog well. Okay, hey girl, hey. What's up? You're welcome back to another vlog. This is not going to be a weekly vlog, sort of like a weekend vlog. My name is Akusia, if you're seeing me for the very first time. If you're a tiny subscriber, hey boo. Hey boo, what they do? So I just got back home from doing some errands. <laughs> I don't know why that was open, but I just got back home from doing some errands. Tell me why turkey is so expensive. Do you guys know the price of turkey? Like full turkey for Thanksgiving? It's over $70. It's insane. Last year, I bought turkey, full-size turkey, at about about thirty dollars ish. But this year, you guys saw it. Like I picked it up. It's pretty heavy. It's frozen. Like turkey is so freaking expensive. I don't know where you guys live, but in Massachusetts, food stuff is just crazy. And I mean, everybody's talking about it. Everybody is talking about how things have become expensive right now, but wow, <laughs> wow. Anyway, let's do a quick grocery haul. Let me clear this space right now so that I can um, do a quick, very short grocery haul because I picked up a few things um, so I can show you guys. But yeah, I'm also testing out a new microphone. I'm hoping that it's doing great because it does look like it's working. It's amazing. I can see if it's recording because um, like the microphone is great like it is great like I see that it's actually working because I see the the movements the the thingy wow <laughs> anyway let me know if you guys like the sound yes my love yes this is this is what mommy does yes this is my job yes I gotta talk to the people I gotta talk to the people so I can <laughs> yeah those are my friends anyway let me let me know if you guys like the sound and let's do a quick grocery haul and then i can get into cooking and doing other stuff okay okay guys so I finally managed to put her to sleep. So she's sleeping right now. Um, but I'm gonna just show you guys what I have because I put them out. So I usually get these snacks for a farmer. These are just like blended with snacks. I got some cat okra. I'm gonna be making some okra soup tomorrow. So. And then I got some broccoli for meal prep for the week. And then I also have some avocado. I got some plantain. I got some goat's meat. And then I also had some habanero pepper. I always buy this in like bulk and I just keep that in the fridge because I'm African and we use a lot of pepper. Okay, I'm not just African, I'm Ghanaian and we eat a lot of pepper. So we got some canned tomatoes as well because I need these. I always use these for my stew and like sauces and stuff. So I also got some beans. Um, I'm not gonna lie, I've been eating a lot of black beans. I don't know why, for, for, I feel like it's fast. It's like very easy, put this on fire, add some seasoning. Sometimes I'll just throw some veggies into it. If I have shrimp, I'll just put that on the side with some rice and I'm good to go. Um, so I picked one of these because I know that I will for sure need it. Um, and then I also decided to pick up this. I haven't tried this particular one before. Um, this is, I think, red kidney beans. Um, I've tried actual kidney beans, but it didn't go so well with me because it took forever to like, cook. And I'm like, okay, I'll just stick to my black, black eyed beans, black eyed peas. <laughs> I don't know why they say black eyed peas. We call every beans beans, but anyway. I'm gonna be trying this out um, this week as well because you know I feel like it's it's fast and it's healthy so I'm just gonna cook some rice add some um, broccoli add some chicken to the side and then I have my beans you know so I love that I love that and then I also picked up some diced tomatoes you guys see it has tomatoes it has chili um, and some like grains so it's like 
this is something that you're able to use to mix the beans and then also if you need to make like some quick tacos in the afternoon when i'm working i don't have time like my breaks are like very short and my lunch is just 30 minutes so i always like to have my stuff like prepped i have a meal prep video that i should edit for you guys because that will like show you guys kind of like what i do for the week but i always have meals on the go like every time because i don't like to work under like that type of pressure especially when it comes to my food i want to be able to like cook with like you know relax listening to music and all of that i don't like pressure so i always have my food prepped for the week and then i picked up some salad i always have salad for the week um i mean i always have salad in the fridge for the week just in case i needed some salad so i picked up some salad and i have some ground turkey i'm gonna be using this for taco or anything i don't know i usually i don't know I, I i can make bagels with it like whatever i want to use it for but i just like to have ground um, beef or turkey in the fridge i don't really mind what it, whatever it is i'm um, cool and then oh i also picked up because i i've realized that i didn't the first time that i picked up this i didn't show you guys i picked up soup dumplings um this is the very viral i don't know if it's like viral or whatever but trader joe's has some soup dumplings that people talk about on TikTok. It's actually really good. I don't have a Trader Joe's closest to me. Um, I have to look it up, honestly. I haven't bothered because I know that in like 30 minutes away from me, there's no Trader Joe's. Like that's how bad it is. So if I have to go to Trader Joe's, I have to travel, I'm sure like over an hour to get to a Trader Joe's. And I don't know if I want to do that, but God being so good, we have shops around that still carry like you know different brands um, of the same kind of thing that you're looking for and this is the soup dumpling that you guys have been seeing on tiktok or the very viral soup dumpling on tiktok but from a different brand this brand is actually really good let me show let me tell you okay bibigo that's the name right here they are actually really good they have I have tried regular dumplings, wontons and stuff from them, frozen um, dumplings from them. And then one time I came across the soup dumpling plate because this is a plate, it comes in a pack of like six. Um, it's pretty much pre-made and it's, I usually wouldn't go for like pre-made stuff like that because I'm very traditional. You guys know I cook a lot at home. But then this particular brand, Bibigo, everything frozen that i've tried from them i like i tried this one time and i wasn't on camera but i really liked it and then i'm like you know what let me actually pick up um, let me pick up another one and then try it with you guys um on this vlog so we're gonna be trying the soup dumpling if you haven't tried it before i will give you my reviews just so that you know exactly um the vibe that it's giving but it's a vibe okay let me just say that it's a vibe i like it if you're looking for something quick and on the go i love it and if you like dumplings you're gonna like it so I'm just I got one of these I just got one because I am not trying to eat out as much you know that does not go well with the fitness lifestyle so I don't want to encourage that lifestyle so I just got one and I have my um, almond silk is it just me or my arms are looking is it just me or my arms are looking a little toned it's just me <laughs> is it just me like my shoulders is it just me is it just me that's feeling like that like tell me you don't see it okay am i going crazy oh my shoulders are looking a little little fit girl shoulder tell me why today my daughter was playing with my color bone like why <laughs> like she literally was doing this and like trying to hold on to i'm like that's part of my body goodness <laughs> anyway anyway you guys um again welcome to the vlog let me get into it i'm gonna just like put stuff around i have to cook some butter make some fufu um saturdays are for fufu in this household not like every day but like you know every yeah, the saturday i'm not gonna lie like we do it every every saturday every saturday <laughs> because like i love fufu my husband adores fufu okay like we both love fufu and so it makes it a lot more easier like we we just love it we just we just love it so um i'm gonna be making some fufu and 
um, some goat meat light soup. I don't wanna, you know, I might cook with you guys because I like cooking with you guys. So let me just be fast and cook with you guys. And then I'll also make some okra soup for tomorrow. Put it down just so that I'm able to create content tomorrow. That's what I always do. I cook Sunday's meal on Saturday, prep or like, you know, prep it halfway just so that Sunday I am not pressured. So I usually just do all house chores on Saturdays. <laughs> so that's what I'm about to get into. Um, and I will show you guys as much as I can show you, but yeah. <laughs> But I don't dare to, I'm too fragile And for that I do apologize Maybe someday we can work it out But I'm afraid it's too late to try Baby, I don't dare to love you And you know the reason why Don't you know a way to make to swim? Can't you feel the waves come crashing? So yesterday we didn't talk so much about the thread mail because it was late, I'm not gonna lie, that's the main reason why, because it was late. Um, can you hear me? Hello, hello, hello. Hello, hello, hello. Okay, okay. So, yesterday we didn't talk so much about the third meal because it was late, okay? This is what it looks like right now. And it is pretty decent, I'm not gonna lie, it's very decent. Like, this is how it's very big, let me just say that. It comes with a remote that you are able to use to control the thread mail and it comes with a fitness app that you can download on your phone and just follow you know work along with people or have like programs based on the thread mail so it's very very convenient like I am I'm so happy like I'm so happy to have this thread mail and then I also finally have some weight at home so your girl is gonna be bulking and cardioing right from the comfort of my home <laughs> from the comfort of my home I'm going to be getting my steps in avoiding people's dogs and getting my steps in <laughs> you know so this stuff is really good yesterday me and the I mean we were all just playing around with it it's really nice um, so it's nothing crazy but it's a treadmill it's a walking pad if you need one i will leave a link for you down below it's on my amazon i got it from amazon so it's on my amazon it's um this is about like 300 something bucks so just so you know and there's also black friday sales coming up so that's good news because if this is going to be part of the black friday sales you can get it for um a fraction of the price so don't say I didn't tell you. Don't say I didn't tell you. This stuff is really good. I'm about to get into my workout. I would do cardio, um, watch something on TV. It's so exciting. But yeah, I'm not taking, I'm not doing anything crazy because it's Sunday, so I'm just gonna go easy. But let's do some treadmill. Mm -hmm. Talk in my pockets, just know we ain't running out the way. Hey guys. <laughs> oh my goodness, my husband is cracking me up. That's Miss Rachel in the background, by the way. Um, from first having breakfast, my husband is helping feed here. And um, I am going to go film some content. This is always, 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 it always works so well. And I love it so much. So I was just using my hot comb to like, you know, clean up the hairline. And I didn't sleep with this wig, by the way. I took it off last night and then I just put it down with the situation in it. And then I laid it this morning. You guys saw me work out, so I wasn't wearing any wig. Um, but I'm just gonna go film some content. I'm filming a makeup video for you guys. I am back to filming makeup content for you guys on YouTube because that's how we started out. That's how a lot of you probably found me. Um, so, what's happening? What's happening? Something is happening. Some hair. Anyway, 
Anyway, it looks a little crazy, so I'm just gonna run my fingers through. Yummy in my tummy. And just like that, my hair is ready to go. So you can imagine. I'm just gonna brush it through. All right, I'm um, gonna go film some makeup look. The next time you see me, I will be beat and ready. So, <laughs> hey guys, so. I told you I finished filming um, the makeup look that I mentioned that I was gonna go film but on a more exciting news on a more exciting news your girl has been picked as one of the ambassadors to be working with the brand Yidi ah! if you don't know what Yidi is Yidi is Lizzo's brand okay Lizzo the Lizzo the Lizzo, okay. So she does have a brand, um, a fitness brand, like a clothing line, and I have been picked to be one of the ambassadors for the brand, and I am so grateful. Like the day I got the email, let me just tell you guys a backstory. The day I got the email, I'm like, me. I'm not sure like I'm like no this is honestly I let you brush it off and in the email they said that if you wanted to confirm that the email is valid you can go to Yidi social media platforms like Instagram and whatnot and send them a message to see if it's real if the message is coming from them they will confirm the message from you so me okay in my influencer bag I quickly ran to Instagram with a screenshot of the email make sure to like get my verification and everything and they verified that yes this was an email coming from them and then i'm like you guys want to be with me you want me to help promote your products <laughs> like i'm not even going to lie this is not like my immediate first reaction because i've had the feeling past i i think i had the feeling last week and it was crazy to me because I couldn't wait to share with you guys on camera but I should have shared the feeling when I had it in the moment because it was just absurd to me that Lizzo's brand would want to be working with me but here I am you guys like here I am I am going to be one of the ambassadors oh I already am an ambassador for Lizzo or let me say not for Lizzo but for her clothing brand Yeti and oh it just it just feels so validating as an influencer to be getting deals like this because then you know that you're you're working you know that like you know people are watching and i'm so grateful i am so grateful i don't take this for granted at all because me working with lizzo's brand i didn't see it coming like it wasn't even in the cards like i didn't even see it coming but i guess my fitness journey and my fitness lifestyle has brought me here because just sharing my fitness journey on social media has made it possible for these people to see me and see that i can be able to promote fitness and lifestyle stuff so i'm just really grateful so to start off with the the you know just to intro me into the situation they sent me a few pieces but the thing is as an ambassador i get pieces every month it's it's crazy like i know you guys know like i get products every month like i get monthly jobs every single month like oh I can't even hold myself. I can't hold myself, okay? So my very first package that they sent me, I haven't opened it yet. I don't even know what I have in these two, but we're gonna look at it together and then we'll see what it's given. But this is a brand, I'm sure you've seen it on social media, all over Instagram. This is Lizzo's brand, Yidi. I do have a coach with Yidi. I have a link. I will leave that link in the description for you guys. If anyone is shopping with, um, I mean shopping for products from Lizzie. I keep saying Lizzo <laughs> and now I'm adding Yidi and Lizzo together. But anyone that wants to shop Yidi products, please use my link, okay? Support your girl, use my link and get some coins off, okay? Save some money. So 
first thing that I have here is nearly naked seamless um, it's a shaping high waist shorts so that's interesting and I I think I picked mine in the shade um, iconic black and then this is in a shade large because large is what I I mean this is in a size large because large is what I wear but this is generally the packaging of all their products almost all of their products and this is the shape where it looks really small but I know that it will fit me because I kind of have shape wears that look like this but then they fit perfectly fine so I know what they're trying to do with this type of shape where let me just say that the fabric is very stretchy what the hell oh my goodness and I could even go on and on and the band oh impressive oh this is so nice and then it comes with the branding on the inside yitty and then it has the band on the like tip of the the situation that it's gonna like hold you so it's not gonna move it's not gonna fold if you know you know okay if you know shape wears then you know your shape wears and you know everything that a shape wear is supposed to have so that's what i'm talking about but it has that and i like the branding like you can see yeti um embroidered in every way and it's just really beautiful like i'm here for it okay i'm here for it elasticity on point everything given let me put it on maybe and show you guys i think that would be nice right let me put it on and show you guys i also actually no i had to film for my instagram so i'm gonna do that because i have to create content for my instagram for yiddy so i'm gonna do that really quickly and then um maybe i'll show you guys insects like some videos from my instagram on here so that you guys see what it looks like so I mean, I'll still show you, just not in this setting, but this is what it looks like because I filmed it from my Instagram. So this is what it looks like on. It's very comfortable, very stretchy. Absolutely love it. I like, let me just say that the, the texture is also really nice. It feels really good. Like it feels very good on my skin. So I love that. So the next thing that I have here is nearly naked shaping midi bra in Iconic. So, okay. So I think it's a top and down situation. it's so small it looks like so tiny i love cute stuff like i live for cute anything cute you know and this will be perfect for working out but also for lounging at home let's talk about it because it gives you coverage do you see that like it's big enough to cover up enough space and then it also has the bandage situation here so it's like She's not gonna move, she's not gonna fold. You're going to feel comfortable, it's going to hold you. If you're the type of person that likes outfits that's like stinks you in or like stays in place, then this is definitely going to be your vibe. And then it still has the UD all over. I like brands that do this because you know, it's giving luxury. Like it's giving luxury brands because they put their logos in like very random places and it's always so cute. I like that, but yeah this goes with the down so i'm working out with this tomorrow you guys will see it on my instagram um but also you're seeing it here so oh <laughs> yeah um but you will see it on my instagram mostly because i'm gonna be doing more videos for yiddy but every time they send their monthly drops out i'm gonna show you so let me just say i'm very grateful yiddy if anyone from the yiddy team is gonna be watching this i'm very grateful that i get to work with you guys um I'm grateful, okay? <laughs> I just really wanted to show you guys this moment and just like share this moment with you guys because I feel like I do this because I love it, but you guys also push me. You keep me going. If you see something that is off, you will tell me in the videos and you know, all these wins, they're for us. I just, I feel like I want other women out there to know that like, put your mind to anything that you really want to do and you can do it. I've been creating content for like 10 years like it's not even a joke <laughs> when i tell you guys my love for content creation started like 10 years ago it's crazy it's not even a joke it's like at this point it's like almost 10 years 
because the other time I was looking at my YouTube and then I realized that I opened my YouTube channel like almost 10 years ago and I'm like wow that's how far back I wanted to be um, like an influencer on social media because at that time in my mind I'm like I know how to do makeup I know how to do this why don't I share with people <laughs> so that's just how it started for me and now I'm like here and like trying to pivot into lifestyle and everything it definitely feels foreign lifestyle it feels foreign for me because I've been comfortable with makeup I've built myself in makeup and I feel like right now that I'm like delving into lifestyle and being more vloggy and like you know just trying to create more content for you guys it's actually opening more opportunities for me than just filming my makeup you know so anything that you want to do it's not too much it's not out of the box you're not asking too much everything that you're asking for everything that you feel like you can do everything that you believe that you have the power to do keep doing it keep going at it because sometimes only you see the vision sometimes only you believe the things that you believe until they show you know until they actually like bet fruit for everybody else around you to see but as I was saying keep going as I was saying before my daughter really interrupted keep going anything that you believe in just keep doing it keep pushing and someone somewhere is watching someone somewhere is watching okay that's all I want to say someone somewhere will see your hard work and that hard work will pay off that's all I want to say <laughs> just in case you want to know these are sold separately so you can buy them you can buy the bra without the pants and buy the pants without the bra so you don't have to buy them together so just for your information <laughs> she will not let me talk so I'm gonna go do other stuff like you know cook and stuff. I don't know I'm just gonna go relax for a little bit I have to edit it's like I have quite a number of things to do I'm just gonna go sit down for a second because I literally just finished filming and then jumped onto this one to talk to you guys to unbox the yitty so let me go and figure out something that I need to do and then I'll see you guys when I see you I'll see you guys a little later when I see you okay you guys when I tell you that it is crazy on Thanksgiving Eve like i can't even tell you how crazy it is if everybody is trying to grab something okay okay i need spices so wow hey guys i am back home i know where you guys are sitting is not a good place i'm back home my kitchen looks crazy grocery markets are just like insane today because everybody is trying to like buy the last few bits for thanksgiving and also because people i mean shops will not be open tomorrow so yeah but let me just quickly unpack everything that i just got put this kitchen together it's 8 p.m i have to put my techie in brine so many things that i have to do right now i'm overwhelmed i'm not gonna lie i am a thanksgiving girl so just so you know but let me quickly figure out these things. I just wanted to check in with you guys. Happy Thanksgiving. You're welcome to Thanksgiving vlog. I know I look a little crusty in my turban, but whatever. Okay. When they say she get it from her mama, mama say you fuck her right, her body do this bump like, tell me in the hall, but come tell me is you down, cause I'm trying to go good tonight, I'm calling who she said to right, I just wanna live in a fantasy, you think we deserve it right, how far the man Good, you can't touch my back, but you could I love fly, I 
Thanksgiving. It is Thursday today. Um, yesterday I went to bed very late, okay, because you guys saw the time that I was even trying to prep my techie. It's currently 11 May. It is 11.17 right now. <laughs> Tell me why I'm this extra. Like, I went ahead and printed a menu for Thanksgiving. This is my Thanksgiving menu, so I'm just going to go ahead and write a few things down and, you know, just get into cooking. Um, I, turkey takes a while to cook, so yeah. But it's a good day. I'm hungry, I'm not going to lie. But I'm just going to get into doing stuff and then we can have some Thanksgiving. Short hair is out today. I'm still trying to find confidence with this my hair because <laughs> I don't know and I also I don't know if the lightning in the camera is good because I'm using my manual settings so I hope that it's okay but the techies here so yesterday I left it to Brian and this morning when I woke up I actually flipped it over so that was about like a few hours ago so it's been it's been doing the things let me just say that brining is it makes sense because it has so much flavor yesterday that thing that i did that combination that i did oh my goodness the lemon um all the spices and everything it just smelled so good so i can imagine how much you know flavor this turkey would have i can't wait to bake it and do my setup and everything it looks really cute and i'm also gonna be baking some mac and cheese in these I, I i think i'll unbox these in the same vlog so i'm excited but yeah let me let's quickly fill out the menu so that i know exactly what i'm making um i like to you know i like to go by the book you guys already know i always have a to-do list or something so i'm gonna make myself a menu um, and just paste that here somewhere and get into cooking i'm excited <music> Show me the color 
you turn me on? The way you turn me on, you turn me down mm-hmm. Done it, I done this before you fall I won't catch you, don't know I'm stalling Cause you love to have them all crying mm-hmm. Gonna be sweet, then Tell me you need me But I'm from a city that's high school I give them the cinema, I go uh, Cause you a bad man, you shit on Friday, happy Friday. Um, I'm at work today. You know, I don't know how I have a holiday on Thursday and work on Friday, but that's my life right now. So I want to box a package from Amazon with you guys, so that I can wrap up this Thanksgiving vlog. This vlog is not even meant to be a Thanksgiving vlog, but here we are. I am so exhausted. Let me tell you. Yesterday, I took quite a number of tequila shots. I'm not even gonna lie. I did. <laughs> and I feel like I don't feel hangover I don't feel anyway I just feel tired I just feel like exhausted so I'm happy that it's Friday because I'm gonna rest um, I have to edit this vlog schedule it. schedule it for Sunday I'm trying to like edit my vlogs by Friday and another thing that I'm doing is I want to do vlogmas. I am going to be doing vlogmas. So this is an announcement that you'll be seeing my face pretty much every day. During Christmas season, I had my calendar situation. So I'm pretty serious about that. Um, but yeah, I want to wrap up this vlog. Just basically wrap up November so that I can prep for um, December because December is just in a few days. And... Oh, before you say Jack, December has started, so I want to get into creating content for Vlogmas, um, and yeah, that's pretty much it. <laughs> but let me show you guys what I have here, because I really do want to. So, I ordered a few things from Amazon. So this is a pedicure situation, foot bath. I don't know but it's used for pedicure you guys know um, but this is not like an electric pedicure um, bowl it's just a regular one so I'm gonna fill it up I don't know if you guys watched the vlog that I was doing my at-home pedicure I literally have a DIY pedicure that I do it's so soothing so relaxing so I'm just stepping that up with this um, foot situation from Amazon and then it has a phone holder so you can also put your phone here and watch something if you wanted to do that. Um, but yeah, I'm going to be doing a maintenance vlog. I think I've been saying that for a while. I haven't come around to doing it, but i finally going to be doing it because, yeah. And then, this one I'm really excited about. Ah! <laughs> I got a Gelex kit. So you guys know that if you did or did not know, I do my nails by myself, okay? I do them at home. I do um, acrylic dip powder and I've been doing them for, I'm not going to say, I'm not going to lie, it'll be like close to like four years at this point. I've been very comfortable. It's really good. It helps my nails grow. I have no issues with that at all. Um, and so I'll do acrylic dip and then I top it up with my gel top coat which is such a perfect combo for me it's always so cute but I kind of wanted to try some Gelex kit um, I don't know I just wanted to set um, like you know try something else so yeah <laughs> so I got this kit from Amazon which I'm gonna be using in the maintenance vlog to do my nails so you guys will see but let me show you what it looks like and what we have inside interesting it has, it has everything that you need it literally has everything it has the lightning it has 
the dehydrator it has i don't even know the names it has the primer it has the nail extensions pretty much everything some files um some gel top coat and then some soak off something that allows you to soak it off that's so cool that's actually so cool so it has everything and it has some designs that you can even do with your nails if you wanted to like play around with some designs so i'm gonna be doing that um this weekend for sure just giving myself some self-care you know my hair is out as you guys can see so i'm gonna be washing my hair just doing the whole nine yards so look forward to a maintenance vlog but yeah but yes guys so that is it i packed up my turkey i put it in the fridge i have a lot of leftover turkey so that's in the fridge um just gonna be using that to cook and have some fun i'm not even gonna lie just play around with some turkey different recipes um but i also have some life fiction that i really wanted to fix with you guys in this vlog but this vlog has been over and above i'm ready to like edit it and get it out of the way so that might be in another vlog um but yeah thank you guys so much for watching this vlog i hope you enjoyed happy thanksgiving from me and my family to you and yours yeah i hope that everything that your heart desires god will grant that for you in another exciting news i think we already did that we unboxed the ud situation yeah i just wanted to share it again that i'm a ud ambassador and i'm so proud of myself and i'm grateful and i'm um, also working with thread beauty i don't know if i mentioned that i don't think i have i mentioned that in a makeup tutorial video that i filmed um, but I'm also a Thread Beauty ambassador, so I have a video, I mean I have links for you guys for Yidi, Thread Beauty, all of that good stuff. Um, so I'll leave them in the description box and thank you guys so much for the support. We keep growing, we keep getting better and I'm grateful and I can't wait to see what next year is going to be bringing. I hope you enjoy the holidays. Bye, see you in my next vlog. <laughs> I'll see you guys in the next one, okay? Bye.